Hi, I'm Suzanne Cantor with TechWishes, and I'm here at CES 2018. There's lots of innovation in the kitchen, and one of the innovators is Whirlpool. Now, we've seen this uh, collaboration between Whirlpool and the ability to bring recipes into their different appliances, but earlier this year, they acquired Yumly, and now you can get all the goodness of the internet on your appliances, and you're gonna be able to take those recipes and be able to use them to be able to cook your food. So, can you just tell me a little bit about how that interaction works? Like, how do you find the recipes? How do you bring them over? Yeah, absolutely. So, I think it starts with uh, deciding to acquire Yumly in the first place. We kind of knew that cooking didn't just start when you put things in the oven. It started all the way back at 7 a.m. when you're deciding what's for dinner. Mm -hmm. um, so deciding to acquire Yemily, we um, took on this amazing company that can provide this endless recipe inspiration and answer that age-old question of what's for dinner. So a couple of really cool things um, that I can walk you through. We have something called ingredient recognition, um, which actually allows you to scan the contents of your refrigerator. Okay, so let's let's just show this over here. Can you see that? Yeah. So Might take a second to load because it's on demo mode. There but essentially, go. once you scan your refrigerator, it'll highlight all of those ingredients that are in your refrigerator and recommend recipes for you based on what you have on hand. Okay. Um, so that's a really great example. Um, and then you can actually pull up um, okay. different types of recipes that involve that particular type of ingredient. Okay, so we have some garlic roasted asparagus, some paprika chicken with asparagus, so lots of different. And the great part about this too is that the recipes that are curated in this list are based on um, inputs that you've put into your profile. So say uh, you've got a gluten allergy, it won't show you any recipes that have gluten in it. So it's really no. personalized based on your tastes. Great. So the other thing I'll show you is guided uh, search, mm -hmm. which I will actually just input an ingredient that I want to use. So for example, okay. salmon. Okay. Um, and I'm really in the mood for this sheet pan recipe of salmon and veggies. Which has asparagus. Which has asparagus, exactly. <laughs> um, so Yemli will actually show you the recipe instructions, uh, the ingredients in the uh, recipe, the nutritional info, as well as some reviews for, from consumers that have also tried that recipe. Mm -hmm. So once you've decided that you want to make it, um, you'll actually just press make it, and it'll even show you the types of kitchen tools that you need uh, to make the recipe. So then I'm going to start cooking when I'm ready and all prepped and ready to go. And this is really when Yemily begins to communicate with the appliance. So I'm going to press start oven and it's going to begin preheating on the oven itself. So this is sending the cooking instructions straight to the actual uh, smart Whirlpool smart range. Um, so it's creating that seamless cooking experience between the app and the appliance itself. So right here it's saying um, it had said 20 minutes until you're going to go to the next step. So it's giving you sort of a guideline in terms of how long things are going to take? Absolutely. So we've actually skipped ahead given this is a demo mode and it's actually already to the point where you would have put in your potatoes. So oh, that's okay. a 20 minute <laughs> step. Um, so it'll actually uh, show you how much time. Then once so these are, okay. these are matched up. So you have the directions on your Absolutely. tablet or so, phone. 100%. So you'll be seeing the instructions mm -hmm. that are here in the app at the same time that you're seeing them on the range. Got it. So once you get the notification that the preheat is done or that the potatoes are done cooking, mm -hmm. you'll get the notification on both the range as mm -hmm. well as the app itself. So say you're not in the kitchen, say you're in the other room watching TV with your family or folding laundry, you have the option just to press um, something on the, app, on the app itself instead mm -hmm. of coming into the uh, kitchen and having to do it on the range. Huh. So there's awesome. that also experience as well. So the other nice thing I like about uh, the Emily app is it walks you through some of those guided cooking instructions. So mm -hmm. having the potatoes, seasoning them with the mixing bowl, mm -hmm. um, chopping the ends off of the asparagus, chopping the fresh dill. So if you are at that beginner cooking level, it provides you some of the tools that you need to get to that next level and grow as a cook in the kitchen. Mm -hmm. So it meets you kind of where you are in your cooking process, which I like. So then it's going to tell you to uh, place the baking sheet with the potatoes in the oven and bake for 20 minutes. This is when it would actually target this on exactly. Yeah. Yep. So that's when it will start the timer on your range. Mm -hmm. um, and then eventually once we get to that point where it's done, it's going to send us an, a notification on the app and then also on the appliance that it's done cooking. So what I really love about Yemli too mm -hmm. is that I mentioned a little bit about those dietary preferences and you know, those right. allergy restrictions. So if you have picky eaters for kids, mm -hmm. you can actually restrict some of those recipe recommendations that come up for you mm -hmm. in your curated list. So 
I've got my notification on the app. You can also notice I've got the notification here on the range. So I'm going to press done and done here. And then I'm going to remove it from the oven. And then it'll give me instructions about how to finish the meal. So okay. that's the other thing that I really like about Yemli is that it tells you all the garnishes. Exactly. <laughs> and it's got beautiful video tutorials. Yeah. Um, but it's also instructing you about how to, you know, do the entire cooking process so that everything is ready at the same time. So the Which potatoes very first, difficult. Yeah. very difficult yeah. to coordinate meal time to get everything ready at the same time, including when you're worried about your kids at the same time. Yep. So I'm going to take care of that, uh -huh. and then I'm going to put everything back into the oven. And then the timer will again start on the oven. Mm -hmm. So then here, so and again, we were a little bit ahead of the range itself. Uh-huh. But then, eventually, we're going to get the option to either keep warm or add more time. So I'm going to check okay. for doneness once the salmon comes out of the oven. Mm -hmm. um, and then I have the option, if it's not quite done, to add a little bit more time on the oven. Mm -hmm. I can do that by either, again, on my app or on the range itself. Or I have the option to keep warm. And this is one of my favorite features because, again, if you're not in the kitchen, if you're upstairs folding laundry, if you're hanging out with the kids and you just don't want to interrupt that time with your loved one, you have the option to just select that on the range to keep warm um, on your app itself. And it'll communicate to the range. So that's what I really love about the collaboration between Yemli and Whirlpool is that it's helping you care for your loved ones easier, make mealtime much more easier, um, and just create that really seamless cooking experience. Thank you so much.